And so with my artwork, with my decorating, with my hairstyles, with my fashion, with my handy dandy notebooks that I've drawn and different artistic expressions and the like, those things have helped me to not only take breaks from the analytical work that I do, but it's also allowed me to express myself in other ways that I actually enjoy. Now, one of the things that I used to do at my home church in Maryland was that I would sing in the choir. And I sang in the choir for 25 years. And that was refreshing. It was rejuvenating. And being able to work not only my creative muscle in that area, but my vocal muscles as well, allowed me to express myself in another way that I enjoyed. And over time, it has helped me to develop my presentation skills. It's helped me to make sure that when I'm in front of a crowd that I'm projecting my voice so that it carries to the spaces in the room and I'm not shy about speaking in places. I'll get nervous. Don't get it twisted. If it's a new place I've never been before, there's a whole lot of folks or people that I don't know, it is possible for me to get nervous. I, I'm not going to say that, oh no, I don't get nervous. Yes. I still get nervous, but because I've done it so often, it's like, okay, I'm nervous and that's okay. I'm going to get through this. And so I definitely credit being a singer for so long to being able to hold my own when it comes to presenting information. 